Love is a temporary madness. It erupts like volcanoes and then subsides. Those that truly love have roots that grow towards each other underground. And when all the pretty blossom have fallen from their branches, they find that they are one tree and not two. Watching you two grow together has been so amazing. I remember Shannon coming to me after their first date and said, wow, I really like this guy. And then they went on many more dates and their connection grew stronger. Matt, you make Shannon a better person. You picked her heart up and put it back together when she needed it most. And I thank you for that. Matthew, how do I even put into words how I love you? You have shown me love in a way I've never known. You have given me the confidence to love you without caution and taught me that true love, peaceful love does exist. You are the most incredible person I've ever known. All of my unanswered prayers have led me right to you, my forever love and my dream come true. Shannon and Matt, as you hold each other's hands, feel the gift that you are to one another. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will countless times wipe the tears from your eyes, tears of sorrow and tears of joy. These are the hands of your best friend, full of love for you that you are holding yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. Pretty. God, you look so good. I love it. In front of our family and our friends, I want to tell you what kind of husband I intend to be for you. I know that we can't seem to agree on who said the words first. Clearly you did. My first promise to you is to tell you that I love you each and every day for the rest of my life because I do and I always will. Yourself, you're always where you are. Go anywhere you go. I remember sitting on the living room floor of my grandma's house after she sold it, crying and reliving all of the memories that flooded in. This is my home, the place I've always run to when I'm sad or happy. Looking up and seeing you standing next to grandma, a rush of emotion came over me as I realized you are my home. My safe place to run when I'm sad, when I'm happy. I know that wherever you are, I am home. I promise to squish every spider that dares across your path. I promise not to complain so much about selfie retakes. And I promise to kiss you goodnight every night. I promise to choose you day in and day out. In my daily decisions, I will consider you. I will consider our family. I will consider our children. I will strive to avoid selfish choices and I will do what's best for us always. Being together is so very easy from that first swipe right on Bumble to all the chaos of getting ready for today. Every day with you is a gift and I promise to always treat our days together as special. I couldn't imagine spending another day without you beside me, so I stand here asking you for you to be my wife and for me to be your husband. Shannon, I love you, now and forever, forever. <laughs> See yourself the way that I do. Today I 
vow to love you even when you take the furthest parking spot from the store. I vow to choose you again and again at the start and finish of every day, no matter the season, no matter the year. I choose you to struggle and succeed with, to fight and make up with, and I vow to choose you forever and always and be by your side. Because of you, I smile and dare to dream bigger than I ever have. You are now and always will be the love of my life forever, ever. I love you. Shannon and Matt, it's my great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife, Matt, and make this your breath. It seems like just yesterday, Matt and I were fighting over his Legos. I was a senior in high school, he was in kindergarten. <laughs> so I'm not sure why he thought the Legos were his. Since there were so many years between us, I never thought we'd be very close. But thanks to my immaturity, we have been very close. I am so thankful Shannon has Matt in her life. I know Matt is the kind of guy any one of us can call if we need anything at all. He will be there in a heartbeat with anything you need. He has changed our lives for the better. I'd like to think that I helped mold Matt into the great man that he is today. But that might just be the narcissistic side of me. Our dad used to say that you should marry your best friend, and Shannon is just that. So Shannon, I just wanna say, thank you for making Matt happy and welcome to our family. The girls are lucky to have a stepmom that clearly loves them as much as you do. And thanks for allowing me to finally have the little sister that Matt tried so hard to be. The love these two have for each other just radiates off of them. I thank God every day you two have found each other and for the app Bumble. Is that right, Bumble? <laughs> I have always wanted only the best for Shannon and Shayla, and now they have the very best, as does Matt, and the girls have the very best. I am blessed to have my granddaughter Shayla and to now officially have three more granddaughters. The six of you all make the perfect family, and I am so very honored, Matt, to call you my son-in-law now. I love you and wish only the best that this life has to offer for each and every one of you. Mr. and Mrs. Chiarelli, along with the girls. I wish you two a long life of love and happiness. Uh, cheers to the Chiarellis. Love you both. <laughs>